Hey there folks, this is FC Gaming getting back to you here today. What I've got something special here is a tutorial on how to make the uh, Pegasus flying glitch just a little more consistent for you. Um, I'm going to show you a little bit of the know-how as well as the application. Now I will tell you right now this is probably what's going to be considered a peach method. Uh, what that means is you probably don't have quite as masterful fingering and ahaha uh, pause um, but what that really means is that you might not be able to quit out quite as well as maybe some of your favorite streamers do or maybe some of the better players uh, tend to do um, what this does though is it will help you set up an easier prompt menu um, so that way when you want to set up the glitch, you can get right into it instead of having to take 30 attempts just to try it once. Um, but without further ado, here is what we need to start off with. So the first thing you'll notice me doing here is I'm actually going into my quit out menu and I'm, uh, I'm setting up a prompt right now. Uh, the reason this works so well is because when you're in your menu like this, you don't have to worry about your systems menu resetting, so you don't have to worry about working all the way over to the quit out menu. Um, you do want to go ahead and, as you see in the top right here, I have my torrent ring set up. Um, the reason this works so well is because instead of having to do as many button presses, you can go right into your system menu, have the quit out menu available, and as you can see there, I get it like within two attempts, frankly. It's incredibly straightforward. Um, the other thing here, and this is just in the Altus Plateau that you can see, uh, but what you, you're essentially looking for here, and I'm just showing this as a primary example, um, you want a slope where you can slightly stand off of it. I get it wrong the first time, but I'm also showing a backup to go ahead and say, hey, I fucked it up the first time, let's reset it, right? So we put them back over there, but what we do here, and I'm just setting up a prompt so that way in case if I fall off. But you, you can walk off just enough here that your feet are hanging off the ledge, um, but the rock right in front of me right there, that's what matters the most. Uh, what happens there is Torrent essentially, he is, he's just gone. He slides off of that rock and he goes he goes home. He goes home for the evening. Um, we call him back of course, we offer him some Mountain Dew, but that's about it. Uh, now from here we pretty much just get into the application of what you can and can't do with this glitch. Um, a fair warning here, if you are planning on jumping at all, I'll let you know right now if you are in the air when you jump. Uh, you, funny enough, you probably won't fall down all the way. You'll probably end up getting stuck in a falling state in the game, uh, which if you've never been stuck in that before, basically how it works is 15 seconds, you die. Uh, you just die. Um, but application-wise, you can pretty much do this glitch and then take it pretty much anywhere you like to. Um, any sort of slope uh, that has an incline to it, you can kind of write up and you can take advantage of it to your fullest extent. I took advantage of it a lot here. Uh, I was looking just for a cheese for Dragon Sentinel here and um, while I couldn't really find a consistent cheese for him, I still took the chance to explore most of the map here. Lendell is completely unloaded for where, uh, from where I'm at right now, uh, which is just a masterful experience. It's a ton of fun. Um, I was able to make my way all the way over to the snowy plains, uh, and I, while I did end up eventually dying to a death plane, um, it was honestly, seriously, just such a treat getting to see so much of this game from a completely different vantage point. Uh, there's so many things that are just yet to be appreciated about how the game is built, how it's how it's made really I mean it just it gives anybody and everybody a chance to finally experience a game from a top-down perspective and get to see everything there is I think that's pretty much about it today if you like what you saw here today or if you thought maybe I could have given you a little bit more detail as to how to uh, do do this uh, Pegasus glitch a little bit easier. I'm more than willing to help you out with it. Um, definitely just let me know. Uh, and otherwise, yeah. I mean, hey, I'm streaming pretty consistently lately, so just 
you know, subscribe to the channel, join me again, and um, that's really about it, friends. You take care, and thank you again for joining me. Bye.